Hi, welcome to Raju's Natural Science Academy for easy and happy learning. Today we are going to learn about how to draw plant cells simply and easily within 5 minutes. And also we are going to learn about structure of the plant cell. We are going to draw the plant cell in the shape of hexagon. Plant cells are surrounded by two membranes. Now we are drawing the outer tough layer called cell wall. It is present only in plant cells, but not in animal cells. This is cell wall. This is inner thin layer called plasma membrane. It is present in both animal and plant cells. Due to the presence of large vacuole, nucleus is present more on the periphery in the plant cells. Nucleus is a most important spherical shaped organelle surrounded by a nuclear membrane and it consists of nucleolus and genetic matter. It is large vacuole. There is a network of tube-like membranes spread throughout the cell is called endoplasmic reticulum. This is endoplasmic reticulum. Some another membrane bounded seeds and sac like structures also present in the cytoplasm called Golgi complex. This is Golgi complex. There are some spherical or cylindrical shaped energy releasing organelles present in the cell called mitochondria. As well as there are many green colored disc like structures are present in the cell. They are chloroplasts responsible for photosynthesis. These are present only in plant cells. Some membrane bound sacs filled with digestive enzymes are also present in the cytoplasm. These are called lysosomes. Large number of granule like structures are present in the cytoplasm are called ribosomes. These are the sites of protein synthesis. These are also present on the surface of the endoplasmic reticulum. Endoplasmic reticulum with ribosomes appear as rough, hence it is called rough endoplasmic reticulum. Endoplasmic reticulum without ribosomes is called smooth endoplasmic reticulum.
Now the diagram is completed. For better appearance, again draw the diagram with black pen. If we apply the colors, it will become more beautiful. Let us apply the colors. We are applying red color to nucleus. Blue color to rough endoplasmic reticulum. This is smooth endoplasmic reticulum. Applying violet color to Golgi complex. Green color to chloroplasts. Dark blue color to mitochondria. Orange color to lysosomes. Pink color to vacuole. Yellow color to cytoplasm. Dark green color to cell wall. If we apply colors once again perfectly, it will appear very beautiful. Let us see. Finally, shall we label the parts? Cell wall. Plasma membrane. Cytoplasm. Golgi apparatus, rough endoplasmic reticulum, nucleus, vacuole, ribosomes, smooth endoplasmic reticulum, lysosomes, mitochondria, and chloroplast. Okay students, study well, grow well, be a good citizen and be proud to be an Indian. Thank you.